guys welcome back to another video oh my gosh guys i feel like i haven't seen you guys in forever but anyways guys i missed you guys i've been focusing a lot on my career development and such so that is why i haven't been making videos or online as much these last few weeks anyways guys i really hope that you guys are doing it well i love you guys make sure to stay safe um and also make sure to never let anybody tell you what they think you need in your life always stand up for yourself and stay strong because you are the boss of your life and nobody else always stay strong and have the courage to do the things that you guys would like to do anyways guys today's video you've probably already seen a lot of videos on the tea of the new arcadia island that is coming to overlook bay but i thought i would cover up some more tea that was released recently i usually like to save my tea videos till later on so that i have all the tea to spill in this video if you guys would like to hear all the new recent tea on arcadia island then coming to Overlook Bay, make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's go ahead and get into the video. <laughs> So moving on to Twitter, um, I am on the Wonderworks Studios Twitter page. So these were the first few tweets that we got on the expansion coming to Overlook Bay. Okay, so in order to get to Arcadia Island, I think you're going to be able to take this hot air balloon. I was thinking it would be like an airplane or something, but I think this is a lot more fun. And honestly, guys, these um, pictures kind of remind me of Trader of the Fairgrounds map. And it's so exciting. Oh my gosh, wait, who is that? Is that uh, oh, that's oh, that's somebody else. I think that is probably the person who's telling you about like the trip and stuff like that. Um, I don't think that is an actual player, but guys, I'm so excited. I'm honestly really excited to see what Arcadia Island is going to bring. So that is kind of just like the first few sneak peeks. I'm sure you guys have already read these tweets already. Um, this is going to be like a massive addition to the map. So if we go right here, this is the island resort. First few sneak peeks that we got of the map. So as we see, there's going to be like a pearl paradise this is kind of like a hotel kind of like the um estates is it the the green building i forgot what it was called but it's the green building in overlook bay where you can stay in apartments and stuff like that um i see like a little bridge over there waterfall so maybe we're gonna be able to go over there on top of that mountain because there is some little um, huts over there. I'm not going on a big vacation this summer. I am going on little weekend trips and stuff like that. So if you guys have any plans for this summer to travel, um, comment those down below in the comments. I love to know. Um, but yeah, I see a little hut over here. I see a building over there. If we go to the next few pictures, this is the inside of Pearl Paradise. Oh my gosh, this lobby is just beautiful. Look at, we have like a mailbox. So we're probably going to be able to have like apartments and stuff like that over here in houses. So um, this is kind of just like a sneak peek of everything. Of course, this also comes with like a botanical garden backyard type of thing like the regular apartments have. So those are just a few of the sneak peeks. And then also this tweet says, did somebody say new furniture? And Overlook Bay's new expansion coming this June. A new furniture category is coming. This category has over 80 new furniture items to decorate your house with. The beautiful furniture was made by the talented Angie Paulette. Oh my gosh, her building is amazing. She built a lot of the things that were for the Easter update, including like the vehicles and stuff. So I'm really excited to see all this new furniture, guys. Oh my gosh, I love this like, little shelf over here these little bean bag things to fill up some of the area look at this shell rug these beach chairs and look at that shell telephone and like decor oh my gosh look at this plant <gasps> i love that plant and it looks like these are like little jellyfish um hanging decor and then we also have this like little honeycomb um wall decor which i'm really excited i really love how the bed has like multiple blankets on it it kind of reminds me of like a resort or something like that so this is kind of um, a sneak peek of all the new furniture that is coming. Obviously, this is not all of them, but I hope to see more sneak peeks in the future. So this one was posted on May 21st. So who's ready to move into this cute ocean bungalow? It's fully furnished, so it's move in ready. The island is calling coming this June to Overlook Bay. And then also here is all the credits to everybody who participated in building this. Such an amazing build. 
deal guys look at this ocean bungalow is a thousand gems per session i think that's what it says so you get to rent it for a thousand gems um it is quite a lot um i will say it is quite a lot to rent this for one session and if you accidentally like log out or get disconnected then you're probably going to be able to have to um buy that again unless there is something in the system that kind of tracks your timing in the game whether if you were out of the game for like two hours or you just left for a second and you came back so hopefully if you do come back within a second you don't have to pay another thousand gems because that's quite a lot so this is kind of just what it looks like on the outside it reminds me of like bora bora guys because they have a lot of those like bungalow type of homes above the water like this this is beautiful okay so right there i can see pearl paradise i'm not sure what this building is right here maybe it's like a like summer shop maybe we get to buy like little floaties or such that we can use in the water or probably like renting a jet ski or something like that that'd be so cool okay so this is what the house looks like on the inside this is already fully furnished so if we buy this we don't actually have to um furnish it ourselves which i kind of like because if you think about going on a trip or like getting a hotel that's kind of what you have to do is that you have to like stay in a hotel or like an airbnb which is usually what i do when i travel um oh my gosh this flower vase is so beautiful i hope this is like one of the furniture pieces as well as like this table it's so nice i think some of the furniture in here is going to be in the decorating section um look at this lamp guys it's very nautical i see like this garland of shells that is super pretty and cute i love these plants over here i've been wanting some more like taller bigger plants and overlook bay for like bigger homes and stuff like that so this is kind of just like a sneak peek of like the inside and then oh my gosh guys look we have like a little indoor pool oh my gosh that's like literally a dream to have like an, an indoor pool in the place that you stay at so that is truly amazing i wish i can like experience this in real life probably not right now but maybe later on in the future so that is just a sneak peek of like the ocean and bungalow this lovely suite is the perfect place for any member of the peachy squad who's ready to move in into the peachy suite this june like this tweet if you want to see more tea guys i think that this was that building in that picture that we talked about that orange building so yeah this definitely looks like it okay so this one's a lot cheaper than the bungalow this one is 700 to rent it is very big on the outside i think it's super nice okay so as you guys can see this one is also fully furnished too and these rooms kind of remind me of like trader guys like do you just get like the trader vibe from like the furniture that you see in this how cool is that and also i think that's the door to go out to like the balcony and stuff so it's kind of like a little mini loft house in a way because it is like kind of open the bedroom is kind of like open stuff and it's by the stairs so that's pretty cool this is a kitchen right here i really like that plant again these food bowls look new too so this is the kitchen and i'm not really sure if we're getting in new cabinets but i think it'd be really cool look at this sink guys this is very modern sink um, I really would like to see this in the um, furniture sections just because I really want new building materials. And also this TV stand is so nice. Okay, so I think we do have this TV already in game. Um, this is the logo of Arcadia Island, which I'm really excited. Oh my goodness. So you know how Overlook Bay has their own logo? I think this is going to be the, their own logo for Arcadia Isle. Oh, wait, it's not Island? Oh, it's Arcadia Isle. For some reason, I was saying island. Technically, it kind of is an island, you know? <laughs> but anyways, guys, this is pretty cool. I think this might actually bring us into another game. So kind of like the North Pole during Christmas where we had to teleport into another map. All right, guys, look at this. This is so cute. Under the sea, darling, it's better. Down where it's wetter, take it from me. I feel like that, yeah, that is definitely a song lyric from somewhere. Um... <laughs> But as you guys can see, this is one of the new houses that are coming into the game. And then also these are the credits to the people who contributed to this house. So I'm really excited to see what is inside and what looks like. I really love how they did like this um, under the sea type of thing of bubbles. Oh my goodness, it kind of reminds me of like SpongeBob in a way. <laughs> that is so cute how they have like seashells and like starfishes going up to the front door as you guys can see. That is so cute. This is what really like surprise me as you all know the island living expansion is coming to overlook bay this june um we don't have an official date as to when this is coming um this expansion is adding over 25 new pets to the game like this suite if you 
want some tea guys oh my gosh 25 new pets guys so there is actually a sneak peek to one of the pets right here this is it's a jellyfish season spongebob would be so excited coming this june this concept was created by Munda Spree. so look how cute that is it looks exactly like the picture oh my goodness guys that is so cute we're getting a jellyfish pet i think is that our first sea pet i feel like it's our very first sea pet because i don't remember any other of the sea pets we've had i'm kind of curious to know what all the 25 new pets are i'm still trying to level up the pets from the molten mines guys and it's taking forever so <laughs> there's just a lot of like new pets coming and stuff so this is the latest tweet that was recently posted on may 29th who is ready to pay a visit to the treasure shack here you'll receive a new tool type to help you find hidden treasures sell these treasures for a new currency and shop the pirates exclusive wares coming this june oh my goodness treasure shack are we gonna be able to find like a stash of like gems or such oh, okay so there's like little bungalows up there maybe that's where we saw before maybe this is like a little hidden area on the island and stuff as you can see it's like a shipwreck how cute there's like a oh, look at guys the parrot pet oh my gosh how cute we have that pet already okay so this is kind of what it looks like up close pete's treasure trove um exchange doubloons here exclusive rewards okay so i think maybe you have to find the doubloons by searching around the island possibly and then this is where you bring it to get some exclusive rewards and like cool things and then right here as you guys can see this is the treasure shack there's like a little desk area in there look at the skull oh my goodness i hope that's added in halloween coming up this fall um this oh okay i guess we can just see right in right here but as you guys can see this is like a little desk area inside the um shipwreck and then this is kind of just like a little overall thing. Maybe we'll get this furniture, hopefully. I have no clue. Imagine decorating a like pirate themed house. How cool would that be? So summerish. Okay, guys. So that is the last bit of tea that we have on the Wonderworks um, Studios Twitter page. As you guys can see, this is like the most recent tweet. Oh my gosh, guys. It is already nighttime by the time I am filming this outro. But anyways, guys, I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video and also, oh, oh my gosh that was too up too up close and personal i hope you guys enjoyed this video and also for those who don't have a twitter i hope i was able to spill some news to you guys i noticed that a lot of you guys don't have twitters so i'm really glad that i can make this video for you guys to see all these sneak peeks and such but anyways guys leave a comment down below in the comment section if you guys are excited and what you think some of the pets are going to be since there's going to be 25 new pets i really hope to see your guys's pet concept in the game because I know that a lot of you guys have been just creating such amazing pet concepts and content and stuff and I really hope that those make it into the game anyways guys I hope you guys enjoyed make sure to hit that subscribe button so that you guys can become part of the donut squad I love you guys so much and I hope that you guys be safe remember to never let anybody take advantage of you or be mean or be rude or anything I love you guys stay positive I will see you guys in my next video bye guys Bye.